And by huge, I mean huge. And it is super special just for the Christmas and New Year holidays. The dream house. It has so many cool things. 70 plus accessories, 360 degree play, slide, garage, and some things that light up. I don't even know where to start. So let's go. Now that we took out all the parts out of the box, we can organize them on the floor to make it easy on ourselves to assemble the house. So the first thing you would need is the pink base area for the garage. And you would need a little green area, which is the grass right next to the garage. Next thing is a big white column with lots of stairs on it. A purple wall with a motorcycle drawn on it. And the basement for the pool, which will be the roof for our garage. All right, so you first take the pink basement and the green grass area and snap it in. So next, you would take the white column and then you would snap it to the basement part that sticks out. So the next part is to take the purple wall with the motorcycle drawn on it and you would snap it to the area where the green grass is, like this, with a picture facing inside. And then the finishing touch is the roof of the garage. So there are two snapping spots. One of those is gonna go to the white column and another one is gonna go to the purple wall. You just flip it over like this and snap it. And there you go, the garage is done. So the next thing you would need is the white door frame with two pink doors in it. The white frame figure. And you would put it here at the front of the door and snap it at the bottom and at the top. For the next step, you would need the big part that is already assembled. So you would need to unfold the bottom floor, unfold the second floor, and then unfold the roof. But for that, you would need a column for additional support. There is the white column. Snap it in here, and then up here. Then in this area goes in the doorway with the doors facing outwards. Let's go ahead and connect the garage to the house. To make it easier, you can snap it from underneath. Let's also snap it here and up here. Come on, Skipper, let's go home. All right, my friends, so we've done the first floor and the second floor. And now let's move on to the third and the top floor. So let's go ahead and do that right now. Now let's move on to the roof. On a longer side, we're gonna snap in a longer roof with solar battery next to the edge of the house. So you just put it in and snap. And you can also fixate the door in between so that it stays there. Here is the shorter part. The snapping places go on this side. You just align it and snap it. All right, friends, we're gonna move on. And this is gonna be my favorite part, the elevator. We would need this pink, pretty long stick. And you would need to snap the railway with the second floor and the first floor. Here, there's a little opening for the railway. So you would take the elevator, put the part for the railway inside. And don't forget to press the button so that it would go down. After you've done that, you can go ahead and snap it up right here and then snap the railway to the third floor. There you go. Also, don't forget to take the top part and then put it on the top of the second railway. They would just hold on to each other and this was done to connect the two railways. The elevator is connected on this side. Move on to the other side. So right here you can see there are two hooks. So you will need to hook them up to this railway like this. Hey Chelsea, let's go upstairs to our room. Let's go ahead and open the elevator and come in. Okay, I'm gonna come in too. Okay, let's close the door and go up. Oh yes, <laughs> next stop, the third floor. Now that we've done the elevator, let's move on to the slide. We have three pieces here. Let's go ahead and take the first one. Snap this one in place. This is where the slide is gonna end actually. So we have, you have to find another slide part that has number two. So this one also has number two right here. So you connect the two pieces 
And then here at number three, we are gonna put the next piece. All right, here you have it, the full slide. Let's go ahead and put it onto the dream house. We have the two snapping spots. You're gonna take the top of the slide and snap it right there. And then you would take the bottom part and snap it to the roof of the garage. For additional support, you would need this pink long column. So you're gonna take the white side of the column and snap it to the bottom with the hollow side facing away from the house. And then you're gonna snap the top part of the column to the slide also at the back of the dream house and actually at the very bottom you can see there are three snapping places for the patio there go ahead and put in the pool in the way that barbie is going to be facing you so let's go ahead and take a swim but safety first and longest fence, put it right above the doorway. So now we can swim. All right, time to go down that awesome slide. Yay, oh no! <laughs> that was so awesome. Now that we're done assembling the whole dream house, it is time for the furniture and accessories. So the first and really cool thing we have is the sofa here that can transform into a bunk bed. Here we have a bunk bed. On the second floor, you could have a sofa and a table and put in the doll. For example, this is Skipper's room. By the way, a really cool thing about the table is that it can fold like this. Or if you'd like another scenario, you could unfold the sofa into the bunk bed. And you can take the same table, flip it around, and voila! You have a little bed for Chelsea. Here you have it, a sister sleepover. On the very top floor, you can go ahead, open up the closet, and then put some hangers inside. You could also put some accessories on the shelves, or you can put the drawer inside. And move on to the bedroom. So you can put a bed right here, and then put a blanket on top. Put the beautiful lamp on the very top. And you can take the TV, put this sticker on it, and put it right there. Super cool, right? It's a dream house adventure. What is also cool is that you can put TV on the second floor. On the third floor, put the work desk right here and orange chair next to it. But if you'd like, you can take the working desk and turn it around to have a warm and cozy fireplace. Now, let's go ahead and put the shelves into the refrigerator. Open it, put in the first shelf, and then put in the second shelf. You can put in eggs, milk, and orange juice. Don't forget to put on the sticker. And then put it into the refrigerator. Put a sticker there. And then there is some dog food that you can also put a sticker on. Put the refrigerator on place. Let's also put in the kitchen, which you can actually turn around and you can have the back. You can put on some accessories. The teapot. You can also put the pan on and hear what happens. And look what happens if you actually put the teapot on. Let's see, what should I cook? Aha, uh -huh, I know just the right thing. Bake cookies. Put it inside and close it. Okay, the cookies are ready. Also set up an area for the puppy in the kitchen. Now let's set up our awesome patio. So right here you have the bottom part of the table and the top part of the table connected to the smaller circle. And there you go. Now let's put the rest. Here's how the patio would look like when it's all set up. And by the way, if you don't want pizza, then you can have a beautiful pink cake. Let's move on to the bathroom. You can put on the curtain itself. This one right here that is included in the set. 
So it has the special holes that you can put into. And there you have a curtain. You can also open the door all the way so that it doesn't go anywhere. Put in the shower. And there you go. You can also put in so many accessories. For example, cups, toothbrushes, hang the towel right here. Hang a hairbrush on either hook, the toilet. There's even some space for it. And put somebody in there. We also need to put on the house number, some lanterns, the speaker. Don't forget to put this aquarium sticker on the grass area to decorate it. It is truly a dream house. Thank you very much, my dear friends, for joining me this week and unboxing this super huge and awesome dream house with me. Phew, we did it. So what do you think about it? Tell me in the comment section down below and please make sure to subscribe, like the video and hit the notification bell to not miss new videos from me that are coming up. And for now, that is it. I am wish you all an amazing holidays with your friends and family and I'm gonna see you very soon on Come Unbox With Me. Bye bye friends.